Hey everyone, Kyle again from ePool Supply. Today we are back with Polaris's Spa Bot. We're just gonna show you guys a quick video on how to clean your basket. Stay tuned. All right guys, and we're back. So today's video, we're gonna walk you guys through real quick on how to actually take out and clean the spa bot basket. So for those of you guys that don't know what this is, if you guys wanna check out our other video of what comes in the box, go ahead and check out the links in the description. We've got a video just showing you guys what all comes included, but this is Polaris's lithium ion powered cordless robotic vacuum meant for uh, basic spas and smaller bodies of water. So I'm just gonna show you guys real quick how to change the basket. Wait, why don't you guys have actually let this thing run and go through the spa and clean everything up. So uh, you'll see that the handles kind of move, it's movable. So obviously it's just easier if you just wanna drop it down in the front. And then you'll notice right here on the back, there's like a little button. So you're just gonna go ahead and push that button and you can see that you can actually lift the entire front off of the cleaner. So that's gonna bring this uh, arm with you as well as the filter basket that collects all of your debris. So again, from here, you'll notice that this just doesn't come off. So your next step is you'll notice right back here on the top, is we actually have, let me this out of the way, we actually have another gray piece right here that you're gonna push. It's just gonna pinch together, and then here comes out your basket. This is where all your fine dirt and debris is gonna get collected. So you guys wanna make sure that after every use, because this is only a one-time use per, per clean, so you have to charge it every time. So once it's dead and you take it out, you're gonna wanna make sure you clean this. So take this out, spray it down with a hose. You'll notice it's like a real fine material, so obviously don't use any kind of pressured hose. Just try to rinse it out and get all that dirt and debris on there. And then you're just gonna go ahead and reinstall it. So again, you just wanna just kinda set it in there and you'll notice that it'll actually start to click. So let me get the piece up. Normally coming in from the bottom first, there's little pieces and it clips in for you. So once you get that clipped in, then you wanna make sure when you're putting it back into the cleaner, you'll notice right here in the front, there's another little, uh, little claw here to grab. And you've got a spot with arrows that are pointing right at it for you that say, hey, put this in there. So you're gonna set that down in there and then just push it back till it clips on the back clip. So real quick, just wanted to show you guys how to take that basket out and clean it for every use that you guys have this in your spa. So really appreciate you guys watching. Make sure to hit that like button. Be sure to subscribe. Till then, I'm Kyle from me, Supply. Thanks for watching our videos. Be sure to like and subscribe down below. We have a lot more content coming up. I'm Greg with ePool Supply. See you next time.